Well, th this is the one the fans have been waiting for. Canada's best shot at a gold medal in the blue. Ray Takahashi, seventh at the 82 World Championships, but more importantly, perhaps the Pan Am and Commonwealth champion this year. And he's up against the tough Korean, John Q. Kim. He's in the red. We'll see how things fare. Who do you like here, Glenn? Well, unfortunately, um, <laughs> I have to go. The, the Korean has beaten Ray. He beat him uh, twice. Handily. They've met twice, and he's won both meetings. No scoring. But, They're back to the center. But if we run through to if we run through to form on tonight's performances so far, Ray should win. Everyone in blue has won thus far. <laughs> and Ray Takahashi has the advantage wearing blue in this match. And they're off the mat. There should be no point there. No point. There. No control exhibited. This is the 52 kilo championship round. 114 and a half pounds. Ray got a little rap on the nose there, Dan. I think he's okay. No points yet awarded. John Q. Kim of Korea in the red, fourth in the 81 World Student Games. With a two-on-one, a bit of a foot sweep, and when uh, his opponent tried to back out of that, he got behind it for a single point. Takahashi on top, and Kim is playing this rather high. All evening, we've been watching the, the men on the bottom really hug the mat, but Kim seems to like it up a little higher. Again, the two-on-one. Flurry there, turned it into a hip toss. Takahashi and Kim both scored. Oh, he's he's got that uh, really tight. He's got it really tight. And that's John Kim of Korea in the dominant position now. <laughs> Takahashi ahead still by one point after that flurry. The score is 4-3. We are partway through the first round, now 5-3, 6-3, as the points are slowly tacked on our scoreboard. This is the final. And again, Takahashi taking a brief timeout. Now, what happened there, Dan? Um, Ray, Ray scored the first point. Um, Korean came back, and by the time you wrapped it up, this one could be six points so long. Right. These two are really going at it. That's Kim with the leg, and he's got the take, has he? No, not yet. Not almost. And there's Takahashi. And neither nice. one does. Oh, that's nice moving. Oh, that's nice moving. Excellent, excellent wrestling. Excellent wrestling. This is the best match we've seen so far. Terrific defense as well as offense in this one. Still 6-3 Takahashi in the blue. We'll see if Ray can take that two-on-one again. That's been his most effective. Oh, there's a hip toss on the part of uh, Kim. Kim. And he's got a nice tight bite on it, unfortunately, for Ray. Excellent move. That's tied this match up. That was three points. 6-6 six, six as the clock ticks down to 40 seconds left in round one. Okay, Ray gets out of it. in the dominant position. <laughs> He's got that tight, tight gut wrench again. But they move out of bounds. Tell us quickly about that gut wrench. Why is it so popular right now? Well, it's, it's hard to say why. Uh, it's an, obviously it's an effective move, and that's what you always want something that's going to be nice moving, nice moving Ray. Yes, yes. Kim was on the attack, but Takahashi turned it almost to his advantage, and Kim that quickly gets the takeout. And Kim comes right back, right back at it. The score is now 8-7. That Takahashi, scoreboard is Canadian, correct. In the blue, still leading by one point. And there goes the buzzer for the first round. International amateur wrestling. We have two three-minute rounds, and this has been a dandy. In the blue, the Canadian Ray Takahashi, the 1983 Pan Am and Commonwealth champion, getting a little air. He's only up by one point. And I, I must think he's exhausted. 8-7 our score because John Q. Kim of Korea has really put up a fight. Yes, yeah, I, but they're just by the score alone, you can see how even they are. 
Um, he may be tired, but he has to keep thinking, my opponent is at least as tired. Once again, these two have met twice before in competition. Kim, the Korean, has won both meetings. This is Takahashi's chance to come back. Is there a psychological edge here, do you think? On the part of the Korean, in some ways, yes. But uh, you can see that uh, with the, an 8-7 lead, the attack is still in it. And Takahashi has not appeared at all intimidating. No, no. Here we go, here we go. In the immortal words of Lamar Leachman, longtime CFL coach. This is round number two. Takahashi, the Canadian, in the blue. Kim, the Korean, in the red. And quickly, Kim goes for the legs, but doesn't make it. Okay, Ray has that front hit and arm. He can do something. And he got it. He got it. He got a one. That's another takedown. 9 7, the, scout, the score. That's a little move that we picked up in Germany about uh, four years ago. Now, Ray is very good at this leg ride. He's very good at this leg ride if he can make it work. Kim defending up high once again. Takahashi's got him down with the leg. Come on, Ray. Put it in. Crank it, Ray. He's up by two points, and the referee will bring them both up. Okay, we got lots of time left, though. We got two and a half minutes. Okay, and this Takahashi throw. tried for the throw and missed. That's another one of his better moves. Of course, Ray developed as a, a in judo first. And as he tried to go the two-on-one, Kim went for the leg. No advantage yet, no points yet, but there's Takahashi over. Kim scores two, and they're out. We've got a tie. Nine points to nine points. Just a minute, 52 seconds remaining. This is round two for the gold medal. And the fans are eating this one up with the Canadian, Ray Takahashi in the blue. John Q. Kim from Korea in the red. Takahashi going for the head. And they're out. Well, they're calling, they're calling uh, Kim for stalling, for none activity. This is the 52 kilo championship, 114 and a half pounds. Kim is down, Takahashi on top. Okay, Plus, now Bray can turn him. That could be decisive in this match. 9-9, nine, nine, the score. This has been so close. Takahashi has led most of the way, but I don't think ever by more than two points. He's on top now, trying to turn Kim, and as he goes for the gut, Kim goes to the mat. Yeah, he's not gonna turn him on this sequence. It's gonna run out of time. And there it they is. call it, they're back up. They're both up. Just over a minute and a half remaining. 9-9, nine, nine. no score in the last little while. Kim, Kim has the advantage, he's around. Kim and he's got one. that tight gut wrench. Can he move him over? He's got Takahashi for two more. That hurts, that hurts Takahashi. 12-9 the score. And that quickly, John Q. Kim of Korea has gone ahead by three. Just over a minute remaining. Okay, they're both up. Now Ray has to come back. He's got to come back. Up. This is where the toughness comes in, mental and physical. Takahashi must attack, and Kim has had his most success at counterattacking. Yeah! And he did it! Takahashi! Takahashi got two. No, he, he's got to hump him again. He's got three more. Takahashi very quickly has racked up the points. Well, he's got that tight gut top. wrench again. He's got to counter that gut wrench. We have got a tie. We have got a tie. 13 points apiece. Just over 30 seconds remaining. This for the Canada Cup gold medal. He's got to counter that gut. Kim's on top and riding. Takahashi on the bottom. 25 seconds. 13 points apiece. No, he One just scored. Kim. He just scored two. Damn it. 15, 13, 17 seconds. Takahashi has to get it up. He has to get it up. The referee calls them both. Okay, he's got, uh, what, eight seconds? Eight seconds. Trails by two. 15, 13. What a match. Kim, the Korean leads. Takahashi has to be thinking one spectacular move right here, right off the bat. And these two have had this place just jumping. 28 points. Wow. And again, Takahashi is going for some treatment on the nose. 
I don't know if he had a prior problem with no, the that, nose. No, that happened right at the first, in the, the very first uh, skirmish. It's nothing serious. Actually, it's uh, not a bad idea. If you can get a little blood showing like that to get a rest, <laughs> he's really not uh, bothered by his nose. Well, he the wants... fact is the rest would help Takashi more because he needs the strength for that one last spurt. All Kim has to do is stay on his feet. That's right. For eight seconds. And Ray is going to try a throw. Ray is the Pan Am champ, the Commonwealth champion. He's got some experience. He has to go to it right here. Seconds One isn't enough. Away. And he Kim, knows it, see? And Kim is giving up the takedown, allowing yeah. the clock to run out. He wins by one point. What a sensational match. John Q. Kim of Korea wins the gold medal in the 52 kilo division. And we have people standing on their feet here for Kim and the Canadian, Ray Takahashi. As we mentioned, the Pan Am and the Commonwealth champion, but he will have to settle for the silver at Canada Cup 83. Without doubt, the most thrilling match of the night. You had this place packed and screaming for you. It was a one-point decision. What were your thoughts when it was all over? Well, was, you know, I was uh, disappointed that I didn't win. Uh, it was a one-point uh, decision, and it was uh, a high-scoring match. So if I would have had a better defense, I think I... You know, I could have uh, won the match. Well, there was some talk among the wrestling community here uh, around our booth saying that if this had been someplace else, um, you might have had an advantage. That's right. Uh, when there's so many points scored, um, especially uh, uh, with the ground moves, uh, uh, there's a lot of controversial calls, but... Uh, you know, oh, come on, let's spit it right out. <laughs> if you're in France, the French referee gives the French wrestler a bit of an edge. You were wrestling today with a Canadian referee. He did not give you an edge, especially when in that sequence when you're all down on the mat. He gave two points that the other officials weren't calling for. Your thoughts on that? Well, I, I'm not uh, making any excuses or I'm not criticizing the refereeing at all. But uh, it is true that usually um, if you're wrestling in your home country and and you're wrestling in another country, uh, usually you can get that little edge by the referees. But uh, I guess I didn't this time. Ray, you only lost by one point, but it was the best match tonight. Congratulations. Thanks a lot.